I thought being Scooter was authentic because I didn't remember who Scott was. I had left it so far behind. Scooter Bra! One of the biggest entrepreneurs in, in entertainment today. Behind well-known artists from Justin Bieber to Ariana Grande. I always wanted to be an example to other people. I would give to charity and I would build a big business. I had built a life that I thought everyone could be proud of. I always thought happiness and success were aligned. Well, so did I. You find yourself wanting to win because you think if you win this time, then everyone will see you. We build this mask because we don't think we're enough. So getting the praise of achievements allowed me to avoid doing self-work. And it wasn't until my life got to a place where I was miserable that I was forced to do the self-work. I did this thing at Hoffman. It was the Hoffman process, no phone, no email, a week of intense self-work. I didn't know what a week could do because I'd never stood in the abyss for a week. <laughs> and when I did, I was shocked with what one week of choosing yourself can do for your well-being. And if there's anything I can say on this podcast, if someone's listening right now, do one thing once a year. Different interviews go into different places. Like this one went to a very deep philosophical, personal place. Yeah. I think people were expecting for you to go deep into my investment strategy. <laughs> Sorry yeah. about that. No, no, no. I'm good. I'm happy that we did this because I think this will actually make a you know Much bigger influence. Yeah, I actually think so.